if you happen to be married to an African man, right, would you permanently move to Africa to stay there with him? No. <laughs> and why you say that? I just wouldn't trust moving to a whole nother continent for a man. If I was in love with him, yes. Yeah, baby! <laughs> yeah. And why? I think that it's important. Like, I mean, my ex is from Spain, and I was willing to move to Spain. Really? With him, so. Oh, okay. Yeah. And why did you move? Well, we broke up, so. Oh, wow. No. Oh, wow. If you happen to be married to an African man, right? Mm -hmm. And he wants to move to Africa permanently. Sign me up. Would you move with him? Yes. Nice. I've been wanting to go anyway, so yes, absolutely. What's going on, guys? You already know it's still your boy, M to the A to the C to the K A Y vibes. Back again with another video. Before we go any further, please do me a favor by clicking that like button. It goes a long way in making my videos get to more people. Thank you very much. So the question for the day is. If you happen to be married to an African man and he wants to move to Africa permanently, would you move there with him? So let's find out <laughs> what they're going to say about this question. Enjoy the video. Uh, what's your name? Man? Kaya. Kaya. And uh, where are you from? Uh, Barbados. Barbados. Oh, that's in the Caribbean, right? That's in the Caribbean. Okay. Were well, you born there or were you born here? Born there. Okay. I'm Nigerian, so. Oh, cool. Nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you. So the question of the day is, if you happen to be married to an African man, right? Mm -hmm. And he wants to move to Africa permanently. Sign me up. Would you move with him? Yes. Nice. I've been wanting to go anyway, so yes, absolutely. Mm -hmm. And, and mm -hmm. why? Well, because it's the motherland. Um, and then also... The so if it's my husband, he's right. got family there probably, and it's not like we will be alone. Right. <laughs> so I'd be down. I'd be down to go. Why not? Yes, yes, yes. What's your name? Taylor. Oh my God! Wow. Taylor, and uh, where are you from? Charlotte. Charlotte. Okay. And like I said, you're beautiful though. <laughs> I gotta say, you all. Okay. So the first question of the day is. If you happen to have an African husband, right, mm -hmm. and he wants to move to Africa permanently, would you move there with him? If I was in love with him, yes. <laughs> and why? I think that it's important. Like, I mean, my ex is from Spain, and I was willing to move to Spain with him. So, oh, okay. Yeah. And why did you move? Well, we broke up, so. Oh, that's why. Yeah. So it really doesn't matter as long as you're in love with the person, even if they're trying to move across the, you know, it doesn't matter. You still gonna move with them. Yeah, okay. I love experiencing everything. So. So when... I asked her. I asked a female, but she said she wouldn't really want to move. And when I asked her why, she said because, you know, especially if you don't know what the, the whole country is about, and then you just move and you don't have anything to fall back on. That could affect you negatively. What do you think yeah. about that? I mean, I can agree with that. I mean, you should always have a backup plan, backup I guess. Plan, right. And but for you, you don't really care. It, I mean, it, I guess it would depend on like how long we were together, how serious how it was. Serious it was like, okay. yeah. So if it's someone you're willing to spend the rest of your life with, you would uh, definitely do that. Yes, if we like worked it out. Oh, yeah, okay. like planned it all out. We already had a plan. We're like. We wanted, like, if we were going to have kids, like, it would be in Spain, but then oh. move them back here in high school. So, so. how did you meet up? You met up high school? College. Oh, college, okay. Yeah. What's your name? Raja. If you happen to be married to an African man, right, would you permanently move to Africa to stay there with him? Hey, y'all, come look at this. No. <laughs> and why you say that? Um, I just wouldn't trust moving to a whole nother continent for a man, like with no family or anything, so. But that's your husband though, why can't you trust him? Well, what if he says he doesn't want to stay here, he wants to, he wants to go back home and stay there permanently with his wife? He got to find somebody else. Guys! <laughs> I'm not doing that, <laughs> I'm not doing that. 
And why why you don't you don't trust that Africa is beautiful that you just stay no, there? No, no, I do. It's just that I don't I don't want to say I don't trust men, but I don't trust anyone completely. So it's kind of like you always have to have something to fall back to on fall for back yourself. On. Oh. Yeah. So are you have you ever have you ever thought of like getting married? Mm-hmm. Are you married? No. Okay. And when you when you're married to your man, obviously you're gonna trust him, right? Mm-hmm. So why can't you trust him enough to know that? It wants, it means good for both of y'all. Mm-mm. No, I'll move states, not out the country, though. <laughs> okay. So, what do you think about Africa in general? What do I think about Africa? It's what not have you heard I've about? Never it? been there. I'd like to go there. I've never been there, so I don't really know. But where, where would you like to go? In Africa. What? Um. No, to be honest, I would go to any country there. You know any, you know any, you know any country? Can you mention uh, two? Zimbabwe, okay. Rwanda. Yep. Oh, okay. okay. You, you, have you seen that movie with Rwanda? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's probably that's why you said that. Right? <laughs> okay. So you say you've been wanting to go? Yeah. Where, where, what which country do you think you would you want to visit? So definitely Nigeria and um, Ghana. Nigeria and Ghana, I'm honored. Yep. <laughs> and why Nigeria? Um, well, so I did my African ancestry and Nigeria, and both Nigeria and Ghana showed up, and actually also Cameroon okay. as well. So I'm kind of like just all the way West African. So, <laughs> yeah, so what, yeah. about, what, what about Ghana? Why, why you say Ghana though? Because, well, so that's supposed to be what the Silicon Valley of Africa, right? right. And I'm in technology, so okay. Mm. You, yep. have any, you have any African friends? Absolutely. A lot? More than a few. <laughs> I've actually got, so I'm an entrepreneur, so I, okay. I'm one of my, I've got a development team in Uganda. So, oh, and so man. I would want to go visit Uganda too. Shout out to UG. <laughs> That's beautiful. That's really yeah. beautiful. So what was it like growing up in, in Barbados? What was it like? Um, Very small town, small island-ish, you know? Like, there's very very easy breezy in comparison to the united states okay. you know um well the concept of time is different okay. you know like everybody here is rushing to do stuff and be on time to everything okay. people just kind of take their time back home you know right and and enjoy so last question have you ever dated an african man before i haven't oh god okay. and why I haven't had none approach you and stuff, mm-hmm. but you don't have a preference, do you? No. So, what will make you want to date a man? What qualities do you look for in a man? Definitely driven. Okay. Respectful. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what else? Um, you have to have personality. Okay. Like funny. I don't know. What about being cute? You don't care. Okay, well, cute. yeah, okay. I mean, looks are important, but looks like, um. But they're not, they're not everything, basically. No, I think that, like, personality is a lot more important than your yeah, compatibility, yeah. I guess. Because oh, okay. everybody gets old and ugly. Right, that's true. Okay, last question. Have you ever dated an African before? No. <laughs> Why? I don't know. I, they've just never approached me. For real? Mm-hmm. What are they doing? You're beautiful. So oh, thanks. <laughs> But if, if one was to approach you, you would, and if it's respectful and cute, you would date him, right? Mm, not now, because I have a boyfriend, but oh, if I were single, oh, okay. yeah. Oh, but if you're single, you would date mm-hmm. him. So you don't have a preference? No. But you speak, y'all speak Patois too? Um, In Barbados? I mean, yeah. The, broken uh, English. Broken English, yeah. yeah. We speak broken English in Nigeria too. Though. Yeah, pigeon. Uh, pigeon English. <laughs> <laughs> I've okay. been doing my research. Oh, okay. So, <laughs> just, so you say you're going to visit very soon, right? Yeah, I want to go for Dirty December. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, yep. I see. Okay, we, we'll be, uh, we'll definitely welcome you to Nigeria, though. Awesome. <laughs> I, I look forward to it. Okay, well, thank you very much. And that's just a question today. Appreciate it. Hello, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, please be sure to like, be sure to comment, subscribe, and share. All this means a lot to me. You know, the more you do all this, the more my videos get to more 
people the more youtube recommends my videos to you know more people so please keep doing this it really means a lot to me i can't stop thank you guys you guys are amazing thanks for the continuous love and support i'll see you on the next one peace out